Welcome crafters, Andy is here and welcome back to the Village Transformation Series. We have been transforming a Minecraft village. You can see all the thumbnails from the previous videos here and we have been loving this. This has been so cool. Thank you for all the likes on the channel, all the comments. It is really, really cool to hear from you guys and to see you really enjoying and getting inspired by this village makeover. Today it's a turn of the little dirt hut. We're going to turn it into little shops and a village. Don't forget, if you're a new subscriber, let me know in the comments and I will comment on your comment and we can add to this village. So let me know what we should do. Alrighty, let's get this done. I got some help. I have some help. I've got these two people. No, wait, these two people, Nutflex and Mockamate, who's going to help with these rehousies. Now, I say three because, yeah, there's three. Now, they're easy to build, easy to copy, so move them. And put little gaps of three between them and line them all up nice and neat. Okay, I'll tell you about all the ingredients in just a second. Come on, guys, move it. But we're gonna go for a count of four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. <laughs> Dude, move. Four, one, two, three, four. I want that for four. Oh, I do three, four. And then we're gonna go in here, that little brick as well, and then just zap this up here like this. So these guys are gonna copy exactly what I do. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> uh, let's come around this side and we're going to go this extra bit here as well. And we're going to go for an extra count of six here. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then this here is just going to come all the way around to there just like so. So I'm doing, I'm doing to there, right? And there are going to copy exactly what I do just so I can build one and then two others will be being, will be being built for us uh, at the same time. Apart from this side, this side will be slightly different, slightly different. Um, let's put these three bricks in here, boom, 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 like that. Maybe do that, I'll do these for these guys. So give, them a, give them a freebie. <laughs> okay, let's run through the ingredients that we are gonna need in this episode. What do you think, mate, what do you think? Hmm. Do you know that uh, Mojang phoned me and asked me what noise the villagers would make? And I went, hmm. And they went, that's it. That's the noise. True story. Okay, we are going to need in this episode some stone bricks. Don't need to be monsters, but just stone bricks is fine. Don't like scary monsters. I do frames. We've got oak wood stairs. We've got endo rods. Uh, red carpet, white carpet. Apart from these guys, we've got different color carpet. And we've got oak fence and wooden trapdoors. And I've got some cool ingredients in there, like an eye of ender and some soups. Uh, white wool, birchy woody stairs, stone brick stairs, an anvil, birch fence, some acacia leaves, an end portal. A cup that's optional. You could use a cauldron for that. It's just a flower pot. And a cobblestone wall, with spruce wood stairs, glass panes, spruce wood slabs, <gasps> pumpful, a blue orchid, some rosy bushes, and an oak wood door and a partridge in a pear tree. Right, I'm going to pick up loads of these ingredients here to start with. Oh, you also need some string. Did I string? You need some string. I don't need a chest. Right, let's get going. So what I'm going to do first of all is I'm going to start with, actually, I'm going to start with something a bit weird. I'm going to start with this cobblestone wall. It's going to go one and two, just like that. And then on top of that, it's going to go two and rods like that. Then we're going to switch over to Hmm. No, we're going to switch over to item frames, actually. And this is going to be what the shop is used for. So we're going to actually destroy all this like that. And then I'm going to go for the oak wood stairs and put them upside down. These guys will hopefully be copying. They're brilliant builders. They'll have no problems. Then we're going to creep inside the little shoppy here, a little market stalls. And we're going to go like that. So this is what we're doing. We're making little market shops. It's going to be cool. Little stalls to buy stuff on. Okay, and on these, we're going to place item frame, item frame, item frame. And then whatever you've got to sell in your shop. Mine's going to be a stew shop, okay? I think it's going to be delicious hot stew that you buy here and you'd be stupid to go anywhere else. <clears throat> yeah. Anyway, some more string. So these guys are selling fish and this guy's probably going to be selling tools and stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's keen. You buy, he wants to buy one already. Serve me. We haven't even built the store. Okay, string, 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 which also turns me soups or me stews sideways, which is quite cool. Uh, <laughs> no, I want stri stri string, string. I've got an upside down stew. Okay, don't spill your stew. It doesn't look good on your soup. Okay, that goes like that. And then string and stew. Hopefully these guys are figuring out what I'm doing. We are going for the little awning or sun cover 
on here like this. These guys are doing well because they've only seen pictures of this build um, uh, from my practice. Well, they've seen it in, Minecraft, in the Minecraft world, my practice build, and they're having to copy me block for block. Do you think they're going to make any mistakes? The pressure's on, oops, the pressure's on these guys. Let's just put a bit of string there and then we can get our carpet on like that. Then we're going to go for, I think, a birch fence and we're going to go boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom, boom. So there's going to be a little bit of living accommodation, and there's actually going to be boom, 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 this here, oh, like that. A bit of living accommodation, and it's a storeroom and a store, and then maybe even a basement if we have some time. Right, grab some oak wood fences, and we're going to go like that. One, two, three. Just like that. How are these guys doing? They are so quick. It is hard to get ahead of the game here and beat these guys, but look at that. They are copying no problems whatsoever. Maka, Maka mate, you're over on this side. Maka's gonna need a little bit of extra space here, actually. Like that. He needs to do, he needs to do this on here. Come on, dude, figure it out. <laughs> build on the left. Okay, uh, what are we going to be doing next? What are we going to be doing? Right, let's come around to this side here. I'm going to go a gap of three, and I'm going to go one, two, three, like that. Then we're going to add on four more. One, two, three, four. A oh, one, two, three, four. Just like so. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Right, and then in between these, we're going to go for um, some more of these planks of wood, like that. One, two, three. Boom, boom. And then into that, I'm actually going to place a, a glass window. Do I have glass here in my ingredients? I sure do. Whoa, some a noisy motorbike just drove past. I hope you guys didn't hear that. <laughs> oh, well. Um, yeah. And then we're going to go for some of these. And then boom, 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 boom. This is going to come up to the same height as that. And then we're actually going to come up here the exact same height as well. So it's seven in total. Hi, and I'm going to block off that window, and boom, 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 boom. I don't know why he's doing he's doing that over there. That's a bit weird. <laughs> Never mind. Um, I'm also going to block off this window as well. Yeah, there we go. Cool. And then Mocker really needs to not be copying like that. Cool. Um, Right, what's next, what's next, what's next? Right, the back of this build, we're gonna put on some of these as well, like that, one, two, three, and then put another window in there. This guy's coming to have a look. Hmm, what do you think? Get out of my face, get out of my face. There we go, cool. Um, and then, more of these things. Boom, 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 boom. And that's gonna be a, a little door wait. We might as well just grab that door and stick it in place just there, like that. How are these guys doing? How are these guys doing? Marker. <laughs> you build here. He needs to build here. <laughs> It is as simple as that. Boom, boom, boom. He builds on this side. <laughs> Flex builds on this side. <laughs> he thought it was the end of the build. Never mind, never mind. Right, now we need some white wool, I think. Some white wool, here we go. And we're gonna go for a count of four, I think. Or maybe even five. Hmm, hmm, Andy's thinking, Andy's thinking. I think, I think it's four on this side, like that. Okay. And we're going to go for four on this side. Four high in wool, like that. How is Mocker doing? He's doing all right, I think. He's doing okay. It's going to be confusing if you watch their builds. Just kind of concentrate on mine. And simply, they're going to be duplicating what I am doing. Okay. I'm going to give them a little bit of time to, to catch up here. Maybe give them a bit of a hand. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Like that. There we are. It seems like a lot of work, but you just got to build one of these and then repeat it another two times, and it becomes kind of easy. Okay, here we stack up as well. 
and stack that side up as well. There we are. Okay, back after the server restart, and I'm gonna just place a couple more details while I think about it. I'm gonna grab an eye of, oh, did I throw it away? <laughs> Where did my eye go? Gotta keep an eye on these things, you know. Keep your eyes peeled. Blink or you'll miss it. How many eye jokes can I get? Probably quite a few. I'm gonna place a couple of little details on the front of this build like that, and probably something like a little flower pot. Can you place flower pots on anvils? I, I don't I don't think you can, can you? Can you? No, you can't. Just a little flower pot down there, just like that. Just a couple of extra smidgen details. Okay, now they're gonna grab some of these and also some burrs and some of these. So we've got spruce wood stairs. I'm gonna place here, 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 and here with a little bit of a trap door in between. Not a trap door. Um, well, a trap door would look actually not too bad, but I'm actually gonna go for some ordinary um, fence posts like that. And then of course, of course I dropped me wall. There we go, grab me wall again. And the end of the build is gonna go, we're gonna go for a count of three. So one, two, three. Oh, one, two, three, just like so. And across here, a little bit of spruce wood slabs. And that kind of stops that horrible connected textures right there if you go boom, 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 just there like so. Cool, I'm also gonna grab you, Mr. Podzo. I'm gonna go for two bits of Podzo, and then we're gonna stick a window in there. So let me grab the glass. The glass is gonna go here. Now the reason I have done Two bits of pods all, so I'm gonna be sneaky and do that, and that's gonna be my open window. Boom, 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 boom. And then we need a plant, a plant here, a blue awkward, there we are. Cool. No. These guys don't copy everything I do, that's the end of the build. <laughs> This is the end of the build. Now they can copy. Copy this. Copy this. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. This is what the bits they need to copy. A little bit of smidgens of details on the side here. Boom, boom, boom. At the back. There they go. They're cooking with gas now. One, two, three. Oh, one, two, three. And then again, you want to go for double podzels. One, two, and a window. Double podzels and a window. Oops. Where's my window gone? There's my podzels. And then. Trapidorus. So let me just pause there and let me show you exactly what I've done on that side. So you can maybe get a screenshot there or just pause the video right there. And this side is going to be pretty similar. Boom, 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 like that. Stick in your orchid or whatever plant fakes your tansy. And then we'll put that there and that there. Cool. I think this actually looks pretty smart. I'm actually really, really pleased with this indeed. Right. Um, we're gonna come up here by one more block one two three just like so and then we're gonna go for a bit of a fancy a Fancy design here. We're gonna go boom and boom like that. These guys are coping not too sure <laughs> Mocha is having such a bad day <laughs> He's so tired <laughs> He's been working so hard all day long and then I've come along <laughs> in the middle of his night to ask him to copy something in Minecraft. <laughs> and his head's not in the game, he's such a good builder. If you haven't seen the Japanese Shell House inspiration series with uh, me and Corrales, honestly, you have to go and check that out. <laughs> Sorry, four hours sleep does that. <laughs> Actually, so, so funny. Right, um, let's concentrate on this little bit here, because what we've got in this house, we're gonna have a little storeroom in here, a living room in here, and a kitchen in here, and it kind of all leads through into the store, right? So you can sell stuff, your soup. <laughs> um, you can have a storeroom here, and a living room, and then a kitchen, which we're all, we're all gonna do that, and then maybe even a basement as well, but we need to get our thinking caps on and get this bit of the build done right here. Okay, so what I want to do is put you there and come across here like that. And we're going to actually put some stairs right here, just like that. Just like that. Um, okay, cool. And then what else have we got? We've got one, two, three, just like that underneath. And then we're going to go for some of these birch fences just there. 
Mark is doing it on the wrong side again. <laughs> just can't get the staff. I just can't get over this anymore. This is so funny. Um, let's seal that up there as well and seal that up there also. I think that's going to look kind of cool. Um, what else do we want? What do we want? Another Trapidorus Maximus to go here. And then we're going to go, mate, it's Flex, Flex. It's Flitz is going to be banging his head. Mocha, do it right, dude. <laughs> oh, it's just awesome. I actually really enjoy this. Um, let's go. Do I have some slabs? I probably didn't put awkward slabs out. So these guys are going to go crazy. Um, let's just put some awkward slabs down there so you can kind of see what to grab, guys. And then Oka slab us this up here. Like that, and that creates kind of a, just a living, a living space. We could stick a window in here, just a place to kind of hang out. And what we can do is put a, a little um, thing there, or maybe maybe one there. Actually, a little step there down, so you can come down here and up into here, and then just hang out on your balcony, tend your flowers, and just chill out and see inside your own house, but not inside their house either. How are these guys doing? I think they're managing. I think they're managing not to bad. Yeah, these guys are fine. Right. I'm um, going to go for some more wool. We're going to go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, three. And then we're going to put some more wool there as well. And then we're going to put a door. A door, a door, a door, a door. In here. This is going to be the upstairs bedroom right there. So put a little door in there. If you want, you could recess this door, I think, like that. It might look a little bit better. Hmm. I don't think so. Let's just take the door right there. Um, we're going to need some more of these wall blocks. One, two, three. One, two, three. And now we're ready for the roof. Hopefully these guys are copying. So with the roof, we're going to grab on some stone brick stairs. I think market is managing not too bad. We want a little uh, window in there. And there we go. Cool. Right, roof time, guys. Um, let's just go... Um, oh, that's too high, I think, with that. Is that too high? Yeah, that was too high with those walls. So hopefully these guys have coped with that. I'll give Mocha a hand because he's... <laughs> Otherwise he's going to melt. We'll have a Mocha meltdown. Dun, 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 dun. He might have said he was tired before we started. <laughs> ah, man, it's made it fun. It really has. Stick a roof on, guys. You can kind of see exactly what I'm doing. It's not too tricky. There we go. The roof is pretty straightforward. As long as you've got all the other blocks in place, the roof should kind of just really speak for itself. Kind of like that. There we are. And we can stick some extra little twiddles and fancy bits there. And there and there. These guys are good builders. They should be able to cope with this absolutely no problems whatsoever. That can go there and that can go there. And then we've got another row to do down here. I was just looking at it and panicking, going, you've made a mistake, Andy, but no. <laughs> Did you detect a little pause in my voice? I'm like, oh my god. Start again, start again. No, 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 this is fine. This is perfect. This is really cool. Um, and it's awesome. Guys, thank you so much for helping me, Flex and Mocha. I really appreciate all their efforts. And there we go. So really, if you just concentrate on what I'm doing and then repeat it two more times, you should have no problems. Going to leave Mark to finish that off. He should have uh, absolutely no hassles with that. Right, I did leave another block off. We're going to need some stone brick slabus maximus like this. And just bring that in on the top just like so. Okay, so that is the exterior. I think pretty much complete. Um, we could add just one more uh, row of bricks there and just come along and do that. And what that would mean is I could put some extra bushies around the side, just like that. There we go. Cool. It's looking all right. Okay. I think we're doing fine. Right, on this side here, this is a kind of an extra special side of the build here. So I'm going to um, just show you exactly what to do over here again we want some of these um put these everywhere i might have not done it everywhere but you could put them everywhere okay mock is managing 
Mother of God, he says. Oh, by the way, I have done this. Uh, I've put that in there. So to do that, you need to hack your way inside the bird and do that. Okay. So Flex is watching. Hopefully Mocha can copy that as well. Right, yeah, this side of the build over here. Let's have a look what we're going to do over on this side of the build. First of all, I'm going to grab some oak wood. And the oak wood's just going to come up there just like so. And then right here. Oh, no, 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 no. Just here, like that. And what I might do is put an extra row of bricks on just like that. So these guys get a little rest while they watch me build. I would have thought. Um, hmm. 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 Yeah, I think I might move that round to there, take that out, and then stick me bushies back in here. This side is slightly different. This is kind of just finishing off the build. Um, some more trapdoors. Boom, boom, boom. And then let's go for some spruce wood upside down, just like that. Cool. I think that's fine so far. I think it's fine so far. This can go along there like that. And then we can just seal up the inside of this build. I think, is this right? Oops. Uh, looks kind of cramped in here, to be honest. Hmm. Looks kind of, what, what is, why is this cramped in here? Well, I think this this last house must be just slightly more cramped than the other ones inside. Not much you can do about that. I think that that is definitely different, right, from over from these ones. Yeah, these ones have slightly more space. Se safety advisor: Don't build under the influence of sleep deprivation. It is bad. It is bad to build under sleep deprivation. It is not easy to build when you're super tired. Okay, so some more plants. Whatever you want, you could go for different. I'm just going to spam uh, red bushes for, for to save some time. But you could go for whatever you like. And just play about with the end until until you're happy with it. You could extend it as well a bit more. But there we go. That is the outside of the build complete. So the outside is done. Let's concentrate on the inside. I've got another ingredients list, so let's do this. We need some books and stone pressure plate, a torch and a crafting table, trapidora, swoop, wooden planks. Uh, we need some furnaces, some birch stairs, a bed to sleep in, spruce wood stairs and a cobblestone wall, a chest and a little fence post. Okay. Uh, let me see. Do I have everything I need? Probably not, but let's just fire into the inside. By the way, Mocha and Flitz are going to be doing their own designs. We'll check them out in a minute. Right. Okay, first of all, I definitely, definitely want to put some sort of floor in here. So let me just stick the floor down. I don't know why I'm using slabs, but I just can't be bothered going back into my hot bar inventory thing. So let's put some slabs. Some slabs. This is slow. This is slow. Let's do this. So what I thought here was, oops, what I thought here is a little store room just here, little storeroom, and in the storeroom, I'm going to put a crafting table and a little, a little, I don't know what that's supposed to be. <laughs> Just put a crafting table. Anyway, uh, and then we're going to put over here some birch wood stairs. Going to have a little table and chairs right here with a little bookshelf just there in between. Over here is going to be a kitchen, and in the kitchen, I'm going to need um, a furnace. I want some, hmm, maybe some dark oak. I don't know, I haven't used much dark oak. Let's just go for it. You could use whatever you want, some dark oak there and there. And there. Was there a guy? Did you see? Hmm. And then a little chimney pot. Oops, let me grab the chimney pot. It's in the decoration blocks these days, which is pure weird. And there, there we go. A little chimney going up. So we need a floor going up. You could probably put another little counter just there as well. So simple kitchen like that, stone pressure plate on the furnace, and we've got a kitchen, a living room, a storeroom, maybe... Would you get out of my house? It's not ready yet, mister. It is not ready. Get lost. <laughs> okay, we need a floor up here for sure. So let's just put a spam, a floor for the bedroom right here, and then we're gonna... Stop looking at me. Wow. Talk about off-putting. Let me grab a bed while I'm in the inventory as well. Add a chest. That's not a chest, but we'll just grab a trap chest. Trap chest, can't even speak. And yeah, there we go. So a ladder. Boom, 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 
bam. And then up into these guys saying they've got it. They've got it. They've done it. They've done it. They're fast. Put a little bed there, a little chest there, and maybe something like a little bookcase in the corner with maybe a, a wooden pressure plate. You could put a table there if you want, but that is the inside. Let's quickly see what these guys have done. We've got Flex. He has separated it out as well. He's put another little wall there. He's got a little kind of a utility room or storeroom just there, which is really cool. He's got a kitchen. Wow, I like this layout. This is really cool. And he's retained the interior window as well and a simple bed. So well done to Flex. Okay, so that's just one more. There's one more house to visit, and that's Mocha Mate. Let me see what he has got. He's got a couple of, got a couple of chairs, torch, um, little kitchen here, some bookcases, and then up. It's pretty, pretty simple layout, very effective, and a, a table and a bed. So cool. Now, off camera, we have been very busy. We have actually dug out some basement. So the basement just goes here. Simply dig it out like that, and that's what it looks like. Not bad, huh? Just dig yourself out a simple basement, put some walls, and yeah. And there we go, we've got a little bit of a basement, but I do want to do something quite special so that you can, we can't really do that, can we? Oh, not string, trapdoor, Thrapidorus, Camiris. Yeah, a little trapdoor where you can actually get access into your basement just like so. Build your walls, build your walls, build your walls, build your walls. So yeah, you could drop goods down into your basement, deliveries and things like that. I think that's going to be cool. And I will assume that these guys do the same sort of thing over there, but that will do. That is our little houses. We've got access to the basement. People could drop in some goods then there, roll some barrels of wine or whatever. We've got accommodation upstairs. We've got plenty of flowers. You could maybe put some flowers at the back of this build as well. Maybe that would be the last kind of thing. I do help these guys out. I think bushies just make everything look so much better in Minecraft. Just ask Corellis. He is the chief bushist of Minecraft. And there we go. Ready to place our houses in the village. Let's do this. Okay, even though this is the last thing to transform in the village, we're not done with this series because you guys in the comments, let me know what we can add to this village. Walls, fortifications, mine entrances, gates, that kind of thing, watchtowers. It could be done. Let me know in the comments. And don't forget, hit that bell button beside the subscribe and you can get notifications sent when I upload a video. Take care. Thanks for watching. With the blocks, be with you.